step aside, Heishiro Mitsuruki. We only have business with one man. Shugen Naokage Kokonoe. No, I'm not finished speaking with this man. Indubitably. Yamabuki! <laughs> I have waited long for this moment. The shade of night is our battlefield. Though strong, you cannot match us. Your battlefield, huh? Not a problem, then. Tenpu Kosairyu was made for combat! My Blade of Shura will claim victory! your mind, or is it fear? Wait, what are you looking at? No, it cannot be. You're too late now, Akira. Okage! Buster, though the blade may be broken, the sheath is still of use. You really helped me out there, but uh, I don't. Indeed, the wound. I doubt I will live much longer. But worry not, I shall die without regrets. You. Gave me another reason to keep training. Is that so? The stronger you are, the more you understand the strength of others. But I know next to nothing of your true power. So, let us do battle again once I'm stronger. I look forward to it. I'll go on ahead once I'm done here. Our next duel shall be in hell. The edge of oblivion. Yeah, enjoy being one step ahead. Shh. 
Shogun Kokonoe, warrior of Shinden Tsushima Ryu. In the fires of hell, we shall meet again! Oh, my admirers are here. Come in. You, huh? <laughs> You've grown into quite the man. You've changed quite a bit yourself. I assume your presence means Gyobu was behind the attacks. Not all of them. But I will apologize for our crude treatment of you. I've done away with the ruffians sent after the Hidden Scroll. The Kokonoe clan are truly splintered. According to Gorozaiman, Yobu Kokonoe's trusted disciple, the trouble began about six months prior. Following Shugen's death, Gyobu became increasingly unstable. It was then that a sinister rumor cropped up within the Kokonoe clan. Shugen's specter loomed over Gyobu's pillow, night after night. After begging Setsuka's silence, Gorozaiman spoke of further secrets. Apparently, a demon assassin was terrorizing nearby towns. This demon can make short work of skilled warriors, and in the two months since you left, even the son of a noble family was found stabbed. A grave crime. If caught, they'll be lucky to keep their head. And every day news of another death reached us, Shugen tormented my lord in dreams that night. So does that mean Gyobu killed all these people? I thought it all baseless rumors. That is, until I saw it myself. My lord wandering around town at night, as if possessed. From behind, he looked just like Shugen, the former demon assassin. Master... Was the demon assassin? He was the greatest assassin the Kokonoe clan has ever known. I see he buried that truth after abandoning the clan. <sighs> if Lord Gyobu is the new demon assassin, then it is a matter of life and death for the clan. We'll need secret hearts unknown to him if we are to win. Hence why your goons came after me for the Hidden Scroll. I'm certain that was their intention, however foolish. If Lord Gyobu captures them in Zanki, they're as good as dead without a way to break free. But you... Shugen taught you how, did he not? I... beg you. Stop the demon assassin. If you do, I swear the Kokonoe clan will never disturb you again. Stop. You don't have to grovel. If that will not suffice, I, Goro Zaiman Yamabuki, shall spend my life atoning for how I have wronged you. Please. Please! Uh, I will think on it. single scratch on your foes that way. Ah! Faint with both eyes and feet. Position your opponent with Zan no Muzan, then attack with Rising Crescent. A fine strategy, incorporating the core Tsushima Ryu concept of cut without cutting. Or so you'd hoped I'd say. 
Why wage a full frontal assault against an opponent well-versed in Shinden Tsushima Ryu? Ideally, Batojutsu kills in a single strike, but real battles are unpredictable. Expect the unexpected if your opponent is of equal or higher skill. Understood. Hidden techniques exist precisely for such occasions. I believe I taught you one quite recently that would serve you well right now. Oh, the alternate Batojutsu technique, Winter Funeral. That's it. But don't lose sight of the crucial part, the sheath. Control the sheath with two fingers and keep the other three loose. Okay. You said you wanted to show me something? What's this all of a sudden? It's not sudden at all. Today is our 12th annual Setsuka Day, right? It sounds so silly when you call it Setsuka Day. All right, here we are. Shall we? Master, but isn't this... I thought it would go well with your natural hair color. Go ahead. Try it on. It's gorgeous. Uh, but I can't. I mean, this doesn't suit me. It suits you very well. <sighs> Cherry trees blossom upon Mount Yoshino. Unwittingly, we thought them snowflakes. Setsuka, my winter flower. I named you 12 years ago. How time flies. So it does. Thank you very much, Master. Master? Come now, dispense with the formalities. Do you know how long I saved for this kimono? Oh, um, then... Sh again? <laughs> Not... father? Oh, I'm sorry. I must take my leave. Hey, Setska. The exit's that way. Uh -huh. After his duel with Mitsurugi, Master seemed softer around the edges. It was as if he'd been hiding part of himself from the world. Even the techniques he taught me after that were different. Many of them were clearly made to kill. Were those assassination techniques master's true skills? Here it is, the Kokonoe estate. The truth about master waits inside. I'm sure, sure I'll learn things, things I wish I'd, I'd never known. known. Be that as it may, I, I must, must stand, stand firm. firm.